to Libya now, where there's still fighting in the city of Miserata. Al Jazeera's Tony Berkeley takes a look at some of the heavy artillery used in the ongoing battles there. This is Tripoli Street. This is the centre of Misrata. This is where the battle for Misrata was fought and won. It's about a two to three square kilometre area. And this is where the most intensive fighting was going on. You can see all around here, every single building has been touched and hit. Tank rounds, mortars, artillery. And you can see the defences that the opposition forces put up. These huge trucks filled with sand. This was to prevent tank rounds coming through and the tanks, Gaddafi's tanks, to progress. And they were very, very successful. You see here some of the tanks that were taken out because of it. But this fighting was very very intense all kinds of weapons were used here you can see some of the ammunition here these are for example anti-aircraft rounds that are used quite a lot and there's so many of these you can't count these are heavy machine guns one of these bullets would hit you it would uh, split a person in two and these are bullets you have also down here a, a whole array of weaponry you have mortar shells you have missiles you have this is a grad rocket these are the rockets now still being used by Gaddafi to some devastating effect and they're causing a lot of damage and a lot of injuries around here but a big problem around here also has been the snipers now you see over here the buildings tall buildings this is where Gaddafi's men were sniping and this was causing a huge death toll on a, almost on a daily basis here before the conflict, this was Miserata's vegetable market, but this was turned into a base for Gaddafi's tanks. They were unleashing terrifying firepower on the city from here. And it shows a very difficult situation for NATO jets. They couldn't see these tanks, even if they knew they were here. It would be very difficult for them to try and take them out because this is in the middle of a, a, a rural, a, a urban area, very difficult with civilian targets around. This was left to the opposition fighters to take out. They did so, and Gaddafi's forces have been pushed out. Now we're talking about a situation where Misrata is still technically under siege, but Gaddafi's forces have been pushed west and they've been pushed south. So technically, it's still a siege situation, but we may be seeing the beginning of the end of the siege of Misrata.